Hey there, hi there, hold their fire family, and welcome to the Narjan Reacts. And this will be reacting to the Dragon Prince Season 2, Episode 2. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get right into it. I left off previously with Soren about to cut down Rayla, which we know that's not gonna happen. <laughs> that's not gonna go through. Somebody's either gonna stop her or Rayla's gonna wake up somehow. I find it interesting she grabbed the rose at the end, too. Yes, strike her down. No. Half moon lies. Like half truth? Was actually I think about it with her holding the rose, looks like she's like dead. Claudia, why are you smirking? I mean I know you guys don't like elves, but come on. So are you gonna Go on. Do it. I've just never attacked someone who's sleeping before. It feels it wrong. Seem sporting. Yeah, it's not. You want me to wake her? <laughs> I'm not. Wait for it to be sporting. Ten seconds. Five. One second. Let her grab a cup okay. of coffee. One. Three. One. Two. Oh. <laughs> but how did you resist the sleep spell? Oh, I used this rose. lovely rose to help me stay awake. Hard to sleep. I knew there was going to be something about the rose. I'm like, why? Why would she, as she's falling asleep, grab a flower? Unless it's something that's gonna either keep her awake or keep this like break a spell. Smart Rilla. Smart girl. With a thorn poking at you. Oh, ow. Uh, enough brandishing your sword, sword. Fight or is this a talent show? <laughs> Instead of America's got talent, it's a. Uh... I forgot the name of the place. <laughs> Zadia? Zadia? Zadia's got talent? Is Claudia gonna step in? Or is she gonna leave with a Sauron? He's having fun with this. He's like, gee, usually the people I spar with don't do very well. Wow. Claudia's gonna step in now. Oh. Never mind, he put a foot up. Oh. I keep telling people, sweep the leg is not a thing in sword fighting. <laughs> like what he told Callum. Sword fighting lessons. I'm eager to learn. Sword Claudia, the freaking background, like, <laughs> it's just like, you, got, you don't know, good over there. Wow, the distraction. What is that? Sticky? Oh, it makes him hot. That's not fair. Does hot mud count as a word? Is she gonna splash at him? Oh, ow. Don't fight each other. Yay, good You're not enemies. Your friends tried to she kill you. She threw mud in my face and some got in my mouth. Okay, okay. I mean, to be fair, you were attacking her first, so can you blame her for defending? First of all, Claudia and Soren, I don't know what you're doing here, but I'm really glad good to see you. Are you kidding? They attacked me. How can you be glad? Bup, 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 bup. One at a time. Let me greet them, and then let me make sure you're okay, and then let me scold them. Okay? That's how it's going to work. Glad to see you trying to murder my new friend, Rayla. I love Rayla's expression in here. Oh, <laughs> I love how she goes from like, you're not scolding and Salson. Yeah, I am his new friend. Ha! <laughs> She's an elf, but a good elf. What do you mean, but a good elf? <laughs> but a good elf. <laughs> I love Rayla. She kidnapped you and Prince Ezrin. How can she be good? There was no We kind of faked it. We went with her by choice. Listen, it's late. Can Let's we like all sit, cool have off. a cup of tea, morning, and talk I about it? Fine. Fine. <laughs> Whatever. Fine. Kill you in the morning. That's uh, Soren. More like it. Come on. That's more like I'll show it. You where you can stay tonight. <sighs> She's like, now I gotta get my bloody swords. That was very confident, Callum. Oh yeah. You've changed. Uh, it's kind of hot. <laughs> Even though your hair's a little messy. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. When it comes to Claudia and Callum, I see it being more like a little brother with older sister kind of relationship, whereas, yeah, I'm definitely shipping more Callum and Rayla. So, Rayla? Kayla? I don't know. <laughs> I don't I remember what their ship name is. But, um, yeah, the, definitely Claudia and Callum feel more like a sibling uh, relationship, even though, obviously, Callum likes her or has a crush on her. Oh, what are you doing now, Viren? 
good whatever time Oh, you've got a beard now. Or the beginning of a beard. Oh, is he gone? Oh, that's right. He's in the coin. May you reveal your secrets to me. Yeah. How are you going to do that? What's changed? Because before you needed the... Uh, you need Renan for his help. What are you is he trying to look good for freaking Claudia? I can't believe... Last time we saw her, you changed her to a wall. Plus... This guy, she's into those things. Her yeah, yeah, but how does my hair look? Hmm... Well... It eh. could be more up. Could be more up, less anyway. flat. Claudia? <laughs> what? <laughs> Trying to improve. <laughs> Take a deep breath. Oh. Looks like a cow lick now. I figured out what's going on. Oh, Why more coffee. Have gotten so Don't talk to me until I've had my hot brown morning potion. Yeah, that's literally coffee. <laughs> that reminds me of so many people that need that when they get up. I don't. I'm not a big fan of coffee personally. Um, I prefer like English breakfast tea or like, yeah, like teas, like breakfast teas with like cream or something like that. But <laughs> I know a lot of people are like that with the uh, mornings and coffee where it's like, no, don't talk to me until I have my cup of joe. She must have bitten them and now they both have moon shadow madness. What? Is that a vampire? Where did you hear about that? Google. Camp. Camp Google. <laughs> Oh, there's a laugh. We need to, do to bring the princess home. Who's that in the painting over there? Is that the... That doesn't look like the mage. Previous mage? Because I know she, I know she said that there have been mages that have watched over this area in the past. So I wonder if that's a previous one. Right. Unless a terrible accident occurs. Accidentally. What? Accidentally. Yeah. Nothing. You mean like what Viren told you to do? Is, we need to butter them up. Sure. Oh, there's the... <laughs> He's like, I'm not doing that. Yeah, I'll leave that nose tapping thing you. Pancake. <gasps> I could take some right now. Yeah, yeah literally butter them up. Okay, not literally. You're not slathering them with butter, but you know. Why should be poison? Oh yeah, that's right. Real food, not the uh, worms These are or grubs. Good. How do you get them so light? Dark the magic. Separating the eggs and beating the whites into a stiff meringue. Mm -hmm. And just a hint of dark magic. <laughs> I was about to say, like, I was joking with the dark magic thing, but the fact she goes, said a dash of dark magic. Yeah, I'd immediately be like, not, not eating that, no matter how good it tastes. Oh, there is no egg. What? What happened to he the broke egg? it, just kidding. You'll understand in a second. He's a baby. <sighs> Isn't he cute? Little Zim. <laughs> Come on, him! Yes, follow for it. Oh, wow. It's a baby dragon. That's how I... Oh. Whoa, what happened to... It's not an egg, it's a powerful weapon. Still true. Someday it could bring death and destruction raining down on all of us. I mean, so could you. <laughs> <laughs> right? She does it. Oh, I really don't want Claudia to be the one, that, the sibling that goes down that path. <laughs> but right now he's so little. Well, <laughs> that loud slap. That was so audible. Get a good look. Because we're headed back. You are uh, you are looking, but not touching. <laughs> the mission is too important. Freaking um Soren and <laughs> Ezra and like eating pancakes in the background while they're just talking and oogling over Zim. Butter them up. We need to butter them up. Don't you literally butter them up, Soren, please. I know you. You all do need to come home. Even Claudia's like, huh? <laughs> because the king, your dad, really misses you. Oh, yeah, Claudia doesn't like that because she knows that he's dead. So she's like, really? You're going to, uh-uh, no, Soren. That's a no-no. That's not buttering up. That's, uh. Did you catch that intense look I got from the elf? I think she's into me. She's not into you. She's on to you. Sorry. Idiot. 
You squash innocent creatures to make magic pancakes. <laughs> potato, potato. Stronger than muscles. Some kind of flirtation. Magic muscles. Trust. Oh. We. I know because, well, mm -hmm. because knock knock. Oh, you really need to tell him. Rayla's look. I I love Rayla's expressions. Between you and what? Me and Rayla? No, I don't think of her that way. Yet. I. You know, good things, bad things. Dad being I dead. The primal stone. What? Sorry, I just had to get it off my chest. Accidents happen. On purpose. <laughs> I'm sure you had a good reason. I did. Zim. I really did. Ah, oh, you're the best, Claudia. <laughs> he was gonna hug her. <laughs> hurt a kid, Soren. He's just a kid. Yeah, Soren's the wrong one to pick for this job. On the other hand, if there's an accident because he's doing something dangerous and stupid, well, that's on him. Never mind. Maybe Soren is the one to pick. And my main glow guy right here, Bait. What's happening? Wait, Toe Bait's man? actually. Oh, he was smiling. I have an idea for something super fun. Mm -hmm. but what is that? Also incredibly dangerous in which some potential accidents may occur. But so fun. That sounds like your typical, like, what is it warning you here when you're going on like a theme park ride or something? It's like accidents may occur. <laughs> Who's in? What is it? I mean, <clears throat> what is it? Freaking um, Ava even looked at Ellis like, um, aren't you like concerned? And then she's like, oh, never mind. Uh, yeah, what what is it? <laughs> Are you an illusion yourself? Well, no. Not right um, now. But you feel so real. I am real. Huh, that's exactly what an illusion would say. Claudia. <laughs> she <laughs> covers the cheeks. That is so like like with my grandparents. They loved pinching cheeks, so I don't know if you can relate to that, because I, I I think it's a typical grandparent thing where they're like, oh, you're so cute and everything, and it's just like you cover your cheeks, like, don't touch, don't touch. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. All, all the lunar moss. Your kind of magic. Not dark. Oh, my kind of magic? What's wrong with my kind of magic? Dark magic. Do you always whisper when you're being judgmental? <laughs> I, I didn't mean it that way. I just... If you want to. Not dark. Not dark. No. No. I want to learn primal magic. But you have to be born with that magic inside you. <laughs> you're going to unlock the it. the thing about dark magic. You just take creatures that are born with magic inside and squeeze it out of them. I'm sorry, how can Claudia go from like such sweet little creatures to you crush them and use them? I'm starting to see kind of like like with how Viren is and how you all in the comments have explained with Viren and how he justifies like dark magic takes a, a person's um, like let's say they want to protect something. Dark magic gives them like that capability and it kind of twists it so they just they justify their reason of using dark magic uh, saying, well, I just want to protect the people I love. Well, dark magic just makes it worse. It corrupts you at the same time. Um, and that's what I'm kind of Like, Viren's already down that path. I feel like Claudia, Claudia is showing signs of it. Because she, like, one was like, oh, such cute little creatures. I just want to hug and snuggle them and everything. And the next moment, she's like, looks like she takes pleasure and joy in crushing the creatures and taking their mat. Like, girl, um, I think we need to extract you from this dark magic of yours. You're doing it again, Prince Judgy Face. Look, kind of hard not to. Here's how I think about it. Don't crush that one, Humans please. weren't born with magic. For a reason. They were born with nothing. Hmm. Don't crush it. Don't crush it. Okay, thank you. Oh. Uh. Are you gonna cut the line after? The slidey sling go fast rope. <laughs> Wait, what if he cuts it, and because Ezra is holding on to Zim, Zim starts flying to keep him from falling? <laughs> what, what if that happens? That is a good name. Oh, well, that's high Are you up. sure it's going to hold? Zim is nervous. Yeah, he looks totally I'll nervous. Show you. Oh my god, it goes over the river. 
He's gonna cut it. That was the best! 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 Okay, Zim, this is your chance to see what flies. You can't cut it because Alice is right there. Yeah! Is he gonna fail at this? You could go again, but what and if again? this time you go first? Yeah, okay, you establish that trust of it's safe. There's I love ancient ruins. Really? Me too. Oh, I suddenly have interest in it now. Everything's so magical back then. It's beautiful. You're beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Mm-hmm. Hey, y your eyes aren't closed. I know. <laughs> Thank you, Claudia. <laughs> Great. It's hey, a date. tonight. A date? It's a date. Claudia. Whenever you're ready. So I'm gonna be able to go through with this. He's gonna fix it, isn't he? What oh, Rayla. Right, about... Nothing. You should go next. Go ha 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 ha. Unless you think it's not safe for some reason. She's so on to no. his BS. <laughs> he hammers it even more. Is she gonna like undo it? Rayla. <laughs> I thought she was really gonna cut we it. Can't trust Soren and Claudia. I thought we talked about this. But Soren at least. Proof now. So it was loose, but then he tightened it. Callum, I know I'm not. Oh come on! Well, but you just have to look me in the eye. Even I got that. She's literally saying that it was loose when e when Ezra went down and was gonna about to go down. Okay, she should have added that Ezra was about to go uh was about to go again, and the peg was loose. But when I told Soren to go down, he tightened it. Like that would have been a little bit okay. It would have been there. Would have been would have been a better explanation. But I still got what she meant. You and I don't have that yet. Yet, even though technically, well, yes, Callum has known Claudia and and Soren much longer. He hasn't been through the same things as he has with Rayla, whereas Rayla has had his back with more and protected him and Ezran from things that could have gotten her killed. So that's a little more special, in my opinion, than how long you've known someone. So let's say, I've known someone for like 10 years. Okay, great, that's amazing. But then if we haven't been through any of the things that let's say I meet someone in the last few months, I've almost been killed, but they've been there to save me every time. That to me is a big deal. Like a bigger deal than someone I've known for m longer. So, uh, <laughs> like why would she, I mean, unless you take it as her being jealous. Cause I would say, why else would you take it as her wanting to fib about that kind of stuff? Plus Rayla doesn't seem, isn't seem like the kind of elf to do that. So like, unless he starts, Calum starts to look at it as jealousy. Like, oh, you're jealous of my friends I've known longer than you. Like, I don't know. I hope they don't go that route. Oh, you hey, look are pretty. Are you doing something different with your hair? Some kind of a braid bag flower dealy? Yeah, it's Sorry. cute. So what? We need to stay focused on getting the princess to leave with us. So she actually trying to sure look good for mission, Callum? Not just having fun. Wait, does Claudia uh, actually like Callum? A zip line today. I took no joy in that. You sure about that? I shall do my best to fake it. <laughs> <laughs> fake it? That's an old illusionist joke. Mm hmm right. Light only falls on half its face, right? Half now. truth. But that doesn't mean the other half isn't. Or there. half moon lie. Strong relationships need honesty. The full truth. <laughs> oh, now you sound like my first three husbands. I'm afraid of First three. But I owe him. What happened to them? It was wrong. Was it? Or was she? Or was it just differently true? Because mm -hmm. <laughs> it led her to that realization. So. I wouldn't drink that. Oh, ew, never mind, not drink. Oh, ah.
I would laugh if, if, if this does nothing. 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 Oh, you're powerless. Useless. I thought you were going to be something special. Gee, let me guess. He's referring to himself. This is, we're seeing that side of Viren coming out where this is how he feels about himself. Mm. Okay. Oh, this is the most emotional we've seen Viren so far. Whoa. That, I'm not gonna lie, that was kind of a cool shot there. Just like, grabs and sucks in all the fire. And, that was cool. Wait, can I go? That was actually like a cool shot. Firebender. <laughs> he's a fire, he's, he's Lord Ozai. <laughs> but with more depth. You look really pretty, actually, Claudia. Oh, don't fix your hair, you look fine. Is he gonna reach for her hand? Oh my god, he's grabbing onto the shadow hand. Hey, take me to see the Nexus. She knows he likes her. I mean, you'd have to be blind not to see that. I've known you for so long. Yeah, me too. Our whole life. Well, sure. well his whole life. Whole life. <laughs> Smooth, Callum. Callum, you always make me laugh. You make me laugh too, and you make me think. Are you two gonna kiss? You make me. Okay, you two are cute, but I do prefer well, Rayla and Callum. Uh, Sorry. Suddenly... We can just be here in the moment without words. Are you two gonna kiss? This is. Wait, Callum, I need to tell you something. Is she gonna tell him about the dad? Oh, that's not gonna be good because if if Ka Claudia has a step ahead and tells her that their father said, and Callum will realize that Rayla probably knows and that she's been lying. Oh no, Rayla, girl, you really gotta tell the truth to him before Claudia does. Or about you're about to lose points if that if you don't. Callum? Oh, he knows now. I'm so glad you're here. Oh no. Really? Of course they they of course they're gonna have Claudia tell him that he's gonna walk off or walk off all slouched and depressed. Oh he knows he's crying! He's crying. Oh no, no Cla now Rayla's gonna Oh no. How dare you! <laughs> don't you don't you like start Putting the coal into the ship for for Claudia and Callum, and then now leave it to where you might put a hole in freaking Rayla and Callum. Uh uh, don't you dare. Are they any of that? Ah no! <laughs> they leave it off with <laughs> you. Know... All right, I don't want to talk over the pictures. I want to take a pic. I mean, I don't want to talk over the drawings. So I want to focus on those. But oh my god, oh, they had to end it that way. Eee! All right. Anyway. Okay, drawings. I'll save my thoughts for after. Drawings. All right, so you got... You got the guy that's been tracking... I think... Yeah. He, you got the guy who's been tracking uh, Rayla and them. You got the guy who was had the... Um, Sun Elf's uh, blade. So they're pointing them out. I wonder if... Does that mean the two of them are going to work together to go up the mountain? After them? Oh my god, that's how freaking Ava and Ellis got across the zip line. Oh wait, so Oh look it's young Callum and young Claudia. Oh look at Claudia had a her little missing tooth and he gave her a fly. So he's had a thing for her since he was little. And obviously okay, she's blushing back. I want So she's had a thing So she's liked him for a while too. She just hasn't been as obvious about it. Huh. Mmm, they're really, they are, they are really cute, but I feel like, I don't know, I just like the chemistry between Rayla and Callum more. Like, they're cute, don't get me wrong, they're cute, so, okay, if. I was about to say, did I just curse? <laughs> Is that a sign? <laughs> but anyway, um, I think, okay, so if. If Callum and Claudia end up together, I won't be upset like they are cute. But at the same time, Claudia seems to be possibly going down the path, as, same path as Viren, which I'm scared of. Because um, I do like her way more than Soren. Sorry for any Soren fans, but Soren is just, like, he's, he's, 
a good guy, but at the same time, like, he was about to... He was literally about to get Ezra either killed or hurt badly. And I just... Mm, it's like, is he such an airhead that he... I don't know. Like, I don't... Yeah, I prefer Claudio. So, like, if she's the one that goes down the dark path, it's going to be sad to see. Uh, but anyway, in terms of ships, um, Claudia and Callum will be cute if they do end up together. But I prefer... Rayla and Callum just because of their chemistry and stuff. I don't know. I feel like they may be like the slow burn one, whereas Cla Claudia and Callum may be like, I think Claudia and Callum could end up like in a relationship, but then something happens. Like maybe Claudia does go dark and they break apart. And then maybe Rayla and Callum, like Callum realizes he has feelings for Rayla and they have like their slow burn turns into a spark thing. I don't know. But yeah, anyway, there's that. Thing that Viren had written up and sent. Oh, there's Haro with Callum. Oh my god, is that- that's frickin' Claudia when she was making the pancakes? I'm sorry! Are- is that a frickin' Zelda reference? A Navi reference? I just see on the jar of the picture- that looks like Navi. Just- oh my god. That's what she, that's the part of the dark magic she added into the, into the paint. Yeah, okay, no. No, that's a no for me. I'm, no. How can you take such a cute thing and squish it and put it into a, ugh! Hey, listen! <laughs> she didn't listen. Hmm. Alright, anyway. Let, let me get into my thoughts. Alright, so. Oh, my thoughts for that episode. Um, well, I pretty much kind of gave my thoughts overall, which you guys know that that's what I'm trying to do more of. So let me try and focus more on like the actual like uh, points. Okay, so plot. Uh, plot was good for this episode. We get them interacting and then trying to con uh, Claudia and so well Claudia trying to convince them to go over willingly. While like this is where you're seeing the con the the different. You have Soren who's trying to get them hurt, well killed preferably, or badly excuse me badly hurt. Claudia is trying to take them back. Like, this is where I don't get what Viren was trying to do, because, like, you have Claudia who's trying to get them to come back alive. You have Soren who... Soren who's trying to get them killed. Like... And, obviously, I don't think Claudia realizes that Soren is trying to do that. So, because from what it sounds like, it's more like he's come out to her as, I want to force them back without telling her they he's trying to kill him. Whereas Claudia just... All she knows is that, oh, we're just trying to get them back to the, uh, we're just trying to get them back to the castle and everything. It's like, how's this gonna work? Like, there's gonna be a point where they realize they both have different intentions with the princes. So, I wonder what's gonna happen with that. Um, so yeah, but plot-wise, he now got it where Callum now knows that their father is dead. Uh, and, of course, Claudia had to be the one to tell him, so now Rayla's gonna be... Rayla's, like, <laughs> is going to be made out to be the bad one because she knew this whole time and never told him, and but Claudia came out and told him first, so. Oh, uh, I hope that doesn't go badly. It probably will, especially with her, with Rayla trying to get Callum to trust her, and then now you got this, and she had this info this whole time and um, never told him, so that's going to definitely put a damper on the trust factor. Um, But yeah, anyway, uh, plot was great this episode characters were great like i, I <laughs> rayla is definitely my favorite um i would say claudia would be closely tied with callum as my second favorite or maybe like as the second favorite if i just her whole thing with dark magic and her being like into cute little animals and stuff at the same time and like yes crush and destroy them for dark magic it's like mm, i really don't think i think you're gonna be the one to go down the dark path and i um I don't want to get too attached to you, even though I already, like, like Claudia. I don't want to get too attached to you, so if, like, you do go down that path, I'm going to be, like, really upset. Um, so, for now, I would say Rayla's my favorite character, then Callum, and then, uh, Claudia. Because Claudia's just, like, a, like, when she's, like, her sweet, like, non-dark magic self, she's, she's really cute and solid and funny. Um, uh, but, yeah, uh. Soren is still Soren. Like, so far, nothing has gotten me to like him more than just being like that. Uh, kind of like he. 
He's just an airhead in my opinion. I'm sorry. The uh, more I see him, the more I just see. I don't, like, I thought maybe that side of him would come out when he, like, it was put on the, like, not put on the spot, but he had to actually enact killing the princess. Like, he would hesitate or be like, I don't want to do this. Like, this isn't right or whatever. But for the fact that he was about to pretty much kill Ezrin, if Rayla hadn't stepped in, he just feels like, I, yeah. Soren is just okay for me right now. I don't know if that'll change in the future, like if he gets more development or something changes in the next few episodes where he actually doesn't go through with it. Then, yeah, he'll be more a character that I, I like more. But right now, he just seems like an airhead. <laughs> but yeah, um, characters are great. Um, animation was definitely, like, again, definitely an improvement from season one. So I'm enjoying it a lot more. Um, music was good. I don't think any music really stood out here for me, but it was overall music uh, good. Uh, but yeah. Um, those are my thoughts for this episode. I hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you like early access to my full and reactions, go join my Patreon. Link in the description and pinned comment to below. But anyway, have a wonderful morning, afternight, and keep bringing bright. See ya!